Okay, so I'm back with another video. My name is Andy from Delightful Boutique. Uh, today's video is gonna be another new iBloom product, new Squishy, and uh, and over here, you can, as you can see, they're the Foxy Fox ice candies. Okay, I believe this is series five for the ice candies. Uh, usually it shows it on the packaging, or one, I remember one of them showed, showed it on the package, I think it was in Shigiri's, um, but clearly there's no numbers over here. But let's just say it's series five anyway, okay? So uh, as you can see, uh, in front of you, there are seven different ones to collect. You probably can't see the back three. So there's like back three over here. Um, but there are two, uh, seven different ones. Now there is an eighth one, which is an exclusive one, which I believe it's like a lighter shade of galaxy. Um, but as uh, you know, unfortunately we couldn't get our hands on it. So that is only exclusive to Japan. Uh, so the only ones you can get is the seven, which is right in front of you over here. Okay, so. Um, as usual, I'll begin with uh, going through the packaging, which, you know, I've, I've already taken it all out. I should have just uh, kept one in, but that's all right. Uh, so, I mean, I'm pretty sure this is the same packaging that I use for all the other ice candies. Uh, so there's really not much to talk about there. Uh, just, uh, again, you know, just with um, the little uh, warning in the back here, or not really warning, but a little heads up, uh, just to say that, you know, so not little squishy, these squishies might have like little tiny air bubbles in them, and uh, that's only just to say that it's not a defect, but rather um, it's part of the squishies. The, some, some of the squishies actually have little holes in it just to make it a little softer. And, uh, and these are all handmade. So, I mean, uh, that's, uh, that's gotta be something pretty special, right? I mean, if, uh, the fact that they're all handmade, obviously they're all gonna have different consistency. So they're all not gonna feel the same. They're all not gonna look the same. Um, but yeah, that uh, uh, makes it pretty unique, okay? So uh, again, uh, let's go through each of the names. So there are seven different ones. Uh, if you've seen the Chigiri video, um, I'm sure you, you know. I'm pretty sure they all got the same names, and uh, and they actually started off as this little mascots as well, so that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, so now they're turning to an ice candy. Okay, so uh, this one over here sitting on the sheep, uh, this one is called Mia. So this one's a classic one. Another classic one, which is the Galaxy one. So this one is called Stella. Uh, you've got this uh, uh, rainbow, but yellowish rainbow, a really light color yet rainbow. This one is Ciela. Uh, you've got the darker rainbow color, which is Aria. Uh, these back three ones are new characters, uh, so they don't actually they don't have mascots for them. Um, but the blue ones called Rias, Rias, Rias. Uh, always struggle with this one. I'm not too exactly sure what it's called, but yeah, that's a uh, Rias. Uh, this orangey brown looking one kind of looked like uh, it's you know fell in the sun or something in lava. Uh, this one's called Lila. And this purple one over here is called Bella. Okay, so uh, those are the seven different ones. Uh, just, you know, looking from the design, again, these ice candies are very typical ice candy designs. Um, they're pretty much, you know, the characters turn into a popsicle, okay? So, um, yeah, that's uh, what it looks like over here. So, you know, obviously with the, you know, the classic um, Foxy Fox, you've got a bit of fur around the neck here, like it's wearing a scarf. Uh, you've got your pointy ears, which is pretty cute. And then uh, you've got also a towel at the back here, which, you know, it, it actually is sticking out a little bit. You can actually feel it. Um, but yeah, I mean, overall, the texture of these uh, squishies, they are pretty smooth, okay? So, um, you know, there are some sticky, uh, there's some squishies that are a little bit sticky. These ones are definitely smooth. So as you can see, uh, and in the softness. So this one, because it's quite thin, it feels like it's quite airy. Uh, sometimes, you know, with the thicker ones, it feel like you've got a lot more to squish. Uh, but these ones, they are quite thin. But as you can see, it is incredibly slow rising. I mean, check it out. It's still not even back to its original form yet. That's how slow rising it is. Um, but yeah, it's a really nice color as well. I really like the galaxy colors. Uh, but yeah, that's uh, Stella over here. Now with Ciela, uh, like I said, you know, it's a lighter shade of a rainbow color. <clears throat> Very similar to, yeah, like in terms of the design, very similar, it's just different colors. Um, but yeah, you can see, very, very soft. Okay, so actually I might go through the scent as I go through each one. Yeah, that's uh, quite a pleasant smell. So Ciela, Ciela I believe is peach. No, strawberry. Or blueberry, <laughs> or raspberry. I actually have no idea. Oh no, sorry, it's grape. It's grape. 
Um, yeah, it's great. So I've, I've pretty much gone through all the set and I got them all wrong, but uh, I just got told that it is great. So, uh, or muscat, so that's uh, it there. Um, but in terms of the scent strength, uh, this one's actually quite uh, stronger than your usual one. So, uh, you know, like in my last couple of videos that are slightly more faint, this one you can smell it a lot more. Um, but yeah, that, that that's great. Uh, in terms of uh, Stella, I didn't go through the scent for Stella, did I? I'm guessing this one's blueberry. Uh, Aria. I'm kind of picking up a raspberry kind of scent. Uh, I'm not too sure. I always get mixed up with raspberry, strawberry, and blueberries. Um, I don't know if it's because it's they're all berries, but I, 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 I'm not gonna lie. I'm just shocking at this. Okay, I'm just really bad at. You know, I kind of. I don't know. Maybe it's my sense of smell. I, I have no idea. But um, I'm guessing it's raspberry. Yeah. Uh, Rias. Oh yeah, so the difference between uh, Rias and these ones, I've also noticed, is that I've got little stars around its belly, okay? So, um, I don't know, maybe it's a space thing, or maybe it's a, a, it's a night fox. I don't know, I don't know, it's got stars in it. Uh, check it out, so that's it there. Uh, let's check out the scent. I can definitely tell this one, this one is mint. If I get this one wrong, um, I'm hopeless, alright? I mean, not that I, you know, I, I don't deny it anyway, but uh, I'm pretty sure this is uh, uh, mint over here. Uh, yep, that's uh, my guess over here. Um, so you've got Lila here. So Lila is, uh, like I said, you know, it's like a, it kind of reminds me like a burnt caramel kind of thing. Uh, it's got that sunrise kind of look. So if this one's a, a night fox, then this one must be a day fox. Uh, let's check out the scent. Oh, that's a good one. Ooh, that, that's a really nice... Uh, very different kind of scent. Like, I kind of, I can't remember which other squishy was it that smelled like this, but it, it's kind of like a burnt caramel, um, which I quite like. It's like it kind of reminds me like the smell you know you get on top of a a creme brulee. You know that burnt crispy uh, caramel on top, sugar on top. Hmm, that smells so good. Mm mm mm. I imagine that would be so uh, so tasty. Uh, so you've got Bella over here. Again, Bella is a night fox, just you know, just because of stars. It's a night fox. Um, in terms of softness, again, very, very soft. It actually does feel a little more dense than the others. Um, there's that. But yeah, very slow rising. Now in terms of the scent, the scent is... The scent is... Wait, wait, I'll get there, I'll get there. Just uh, just bear with me. The scent is... Why can't I think of it? I can't tell. Like, I'm so afraid to just say something now because I know I'm gonna get it wrong. Um, so sometimes it's better not to say anything at all. So that way I can't be wrong. Uh, but I will leave all the uh, correct scents in the description below, uh, box below this video. So um, yeah, just you know, don't don't take my word for it. Uh, like I said, in terms of scents, I don't know why or like you know, you think that I'd get better by now, um, but I just have a really you know poor sense of smell. Like that's that's probably my only conclusion. Um, so yeah, unfortunately, that's uh, just the way I am. All right, so. I really honestly can't tell what this one is. It, it does smell fruity. Um, like, I, I would say it's blueberry, but I'm probably wrong, okay? So, oh wait, I forgot about, um, what's this one called, Mia. Let's just pretend I, I never touched Mia, and, uh, and that way, you know, I don't know the sense of it, okay? So, um, but that's, a, that's pretty much it. So you, you do have seven different ones to collect. Uh, again, this is the new iBloom Ice Candy series number five? Five? Five, yeah, five. Uh, you know, the previous uh, Foxy Fox, there were Chigiris. Uh, so now, you know, it turned into Ice Candy, which is pretty cool. Um, if you're a big fan of Ice Candies, then, you know, of course I highly recommend these. Uh, if you want to grab one for, the, for yourselves, then uh, make sure you head over to delightfulboutique.com. Um, just search up, you know, ice candy or go through the new album catalog. Uh, it should all be there. Okay. So 
Uh, as always, yeah, thank you so much for watching these videos. I really do hope that it helped you out on, you know, whether you like the squishy or not. Uh, you know, I'm always happy to do these new videos. If you do have any kind of suggestions that you want me to do, uh, again, always, you know, leave the comments uh, in the below and I'll check them out and see if we have them, then I'll shoot a video for it. Uh, if we don't, then I'll try to find it somehow. Um, I don't know, maybe not. Uh, but yeah, I, I, again, you know, thank you so much. If you do enjoy this video, then make sure that you give us a uh, thumbs up. You know, that's, uh, that'd be really much appreciated. Uh, if you haven't already, then, uh, you know, what are you waiting for? Make sure that you do subscribe to, um, to this channel. And, uh, and that's uh, pretty much it, okay? So I don't have anything planned for the next few videos. Uh, hopefully, we'll see what's coming next. Um, but yeah, I mean, thank you so much for watching. And I do appreciate you guys. And I hope you guys uh, have a good day, okay? So look forward to seeing you guys in the next video.